Hey shipmates, it's hard to believe but it was just over a year ago that we first talked about our journey together. At that time I was at the Washington Navy Yard near the fighting top of the USS Constitution. Well here we are, it's been a year and it's amazing how time flies when you're having fun. We talked about the 200th commemoration of the War of 1812 and how we were going to celebrate it because it's important for our tradition and to understand our heritage. Well here I am in Detroit, Michigan. We've been at the 200th commemoration. We've been up and down the East Coast. We've been in the Gulf of Mexico. Here we're in Detroit, Michigan. And just over my right shoulder is the Brig Niagara. Now the Brig Niagara was a major part of the War of 1812. That was the ship Commodore Oliver Hazard Perry continued and won the Battle of Lake Erie. And remember, it was the Battle of Lake Erie that turned the tide in this part of the country of the War of 1812 and really turned the entire war of 1812. This is our legacy and this is our tradition. Bold people, innovative people, and brave people who are willing to carry the fight to the enemy. This continued in the Civil War, continued in World War I, in World War II, the Vietnam War, and this is the tradition and legacy that you are writing today. You are out and about in this world carrying our message and protecting the freedom on the seas. So as we continue ahead into this next year, remember our tenants. War fighting is first, we will operate forward, and we will be ready. We will be ready today to answer the call when we are called, and we will build the force of tomorrow that enables those that come after us to be ready and continue that fight. And we will do so with a powerful, diverse force. So I want to thank you for what you do. I'm proud to serve with you. And I want to thank your families, because they are the wind underneath our wings. They are our foundation. So happy birthday, shipmates. And I'll see you out there in the fleet.